Hey Indies, what's going on? It's Deck here. Welcome back to another mod review. Today we're going to look at the Stu's Plus mod from Paul two four zero no two zero four seven two four seven. I think it was a really long username, so that's pushing on my memory. So sorry if I didn't get your name exactly right, Paul. Um, it was from Paul. That's what we're gonna call it. Um, remember, if you want to download this mod, check it out. Um, link will be down in the description below to download the mod. So. Let's get started here. This mod adds 16 different stews, I believe, to Minecraft, starting with the sugar stew. Now, some of these um, stews, if you eat them, I think seven of them added give you kind of like a potion effect, but uh, I'm not going to be getting to I'll get to that at the end after we kind of go over what all the stews are. So, the first one is sugar stew. You put sugar around a bowl, you get sugar stew. That's one of the ones that has a potion effect. Redstone stew is another one that has a potion effect. Redstone around a bowl, as you would expect. Apple stew, apples around a bowl, as you would expect. Pork stew, pork chops, cooked pork chops around a bowl, as you would expect. Same along with the beef stew here. The flesh stew, you take rotten flesh. This is one that um, I was not sure I tried for ages to figure out what the recipe was. It might not have a recipe. I couldn't find anywhere any information on it. So, I'm going to assume I was just not able to find it. This is water stew. Uh, we will get back to that one later. What it does, I could not figure out how to make it, though. This is eye stew, which you use make by putting spider eyes around your bowl, and you get eye stew. And then chicken stew, which, as you might have guessed, would be cooked chickens around a bowl, and you get chicken stew. So, let's move on up here. We have gold stew, which all you do is put gold nuggets I actually thought it was gold ingots at first, and I was really confused why I couldn't get it to work. But then I kind of forgot, while well, sitting there with gold ingots, trying to figure out how to make it. Because he said just put the eight around it. But I kind of forgot about the existence of these gold nuggets, so I spent forever figuring out how to do it. So that is how you make golden stew. Nether stew. I couldn't figure this one out for a while because I forgot about nether warts too. <sighs> but nether warts around a bowl, and you get nether stew. Fish stew is eight cooked fish around a bowl. Carrot stew is eight carrots around a bowl. Potato stew is raw pota regular potatoes. You cannot use cooked potatoes. I tried that one out. You cannot use cooked potatoes on this. You have to use regular potatoes. Your pumpkin stew, which would be eight pumpkins around a bowl, and you can get pumpkin stew. And bread stew, which is eight bread around a bowl, and you get bread stew. So that's it for the stews, but now let's go ahead and look at what their potions effects are. If a potion, that Whoops, just hit Windows key. So I'm going to go ahead and game mode myself to survival mode. And let's look at the potion effects. Now, starting with the sugar stew. Sugar stew does what sugar does. If you drink... Oh, man. Got to work down my hunger a little bit. Hold on, let's just bump up our difficulty here. And let's run around for a little bit. I didn't realize I was going to have to work down my difficulty. Uh, I kind of assumed that they were set in the code to be always edible. But I'm incorrect about that. See, we're assuming get you guys. So, let's just run around the forest for a little bit. I believe all the stews, um, all the regular stews at least, do the exact same. Um, they heal the same amount of uh, chicken nuggets or whatever you prefer to call your food bar. I think they all do the same as regular stew. The mod description wasn't super clear over on Planet Minecraft where I found this mod, so. Alright, so let's just... Okay, so I've worked off enough a little bit here so we can drink a drink of this stew. And... We now have speed. For 40 seconds, we move twice as fast or so. Probably a little more than twice as fast. Is it speed 2? No, just speed 1. Hey zombie, why you Oh, you're in water. That's why you're not burning. Okay. I'm just going to leave you be, buddy. We don't we don't have to fight. We're friends here. Everyone's friends here. So, the redstone stew is another one, and it kind of stinks that we have this annoying food problem here. So, I'm going to just take a run. Let's work down my food bar a little bit lower so we can continue eating stew. I didn't actually um anticipate this coming. So, I kind of forgot that you I have to do this. So, let's go run around. Mm. 
Mm, working my food bar down, working it down by running around. We're working our food bar down, food bar down, yeah. All right, so my food bar is down a little bit, so now we're going to eat the redstone stew. Let's go ahead and eat this, but also we are going to need to, to show exactly what this does, grab a diamond pickaxe out, and we'll see I mine at amazing speeds. So this will last for, I think they're all 40 seconds. So it just gives you the haste um, potion effect. And so now I just mine faster than usual. So that is what Redstone Stew does. Which I actually think is like a pretty cool use for Redstone Stew. Although, it honestly, I like honestly I don't think it can be healthy to eat. It's like, well Redstone is kind of like the wire. And lots of, lots of wire is copper. So it's kind of like just eating copper. Which cannot be good at all. Uh, we're going to skip over a few of these here. Flesh stew does exactly what rotten flesh does. It may The potion effect may be a little bit different. Eye stew does exactly what eating a spider eye does, but it may be a little bit different. I haven't tried them out, but I know what they basically do. So, did I miss any? Oh, water stew. Yeah, I missed that one. So, water stew. Take this. You can see now. See? See the bubbles? For your... That may have been 20 seconds. I didn't check. But I, th I think about it. It had to be 20, yeah, because I, I wasted a few seconds. Well, maybe not. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it was 16. I don't know. So for a certain amount of time, I will not have my bubbles go down so we can breathe underwater. So now they're about to go down. There we are. So we can breathe underwater for a small amount of time when we drink that. All right. So moving up here, we have our golden stew, which I just wrote gold on the sign for some reason because I'm stupid. All right. Deal with it. Deal with it. All right, so our golden stew does the same thing a golden apple does. However, I have to go dive off a tree to give you a good example, my friends. And for the sake of reviving old internet jokes, this is Sparta. Ah! I lived. Well, I wanted to live, but. Oh, I can't eat this. It's not said as always edible. I recommend mod creator in the declaration of this, the items. Just type in dot set. Always edible. I think is the is the just I think it's that simple. Just that little bit of code. If you didn't know that, it makes it so like golden apples, so you can always eat them. I I feel like I should be able to always eat this this stew, my friend, because I like to get high off regeneration potions. It's fun. Ooh, you also not die. We're out in the desert doing it again. Running around the pond to bring our food down again. To bring the food bar down. To bring the food bar down. To splash you in the water. And bring the food bar down. Bring the food bar down. Bring, bring, bring the food bar down. Yes! Yes! It dropped! It dropped! Yes! A little bit of progress! Soon leads to a lot of part, a lot of bit of progress. <laughs> this is modern science. Yes, yes. Do 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 do. I failed on that one. Wow. If you could recognize that, I'm impressed or disappointed, huh? Who cares? Alright, so we are plenty damaged and ready to eat this golden stew, so let's take a bite. And now we have regeneration for 20 seconds, so look as our little heart down there, they do the little, do the twist and bounce around and have a party. Yay! It also actually did, I think that healed more food bar things than the other ones. So what's left? We have the nether stew, that, that is left. I believe the nether stew gives me... Fire resistance? Is this one always edible? No, it's not. Dang it. Oh, so much running around involved. I wish there was a way to uh, change this. Like, with a command. Like, set food bar. Nothing. Starve? Nick knack. That's No, that's mulk. Nick knack. Nope, doesn't work. Oh, well. After taking my expedition through the desert for many years, 
I finally arrived back home. All right, and now we can try out the last stew. So let's take a nice big thing of our nether stew, and we get one minute of fire resistance. So let's go ahead and give this a shot. Seems effective. Seems very effective. I am not burning to death. Ah, this is nice and warm. Let's cool down for a second. Oh, yeah. Let's hop back in the fire. Oh, yeah. Well, let's make this a hot tub down here. All right, so all we need to do is just break a block of dirt. Oh, it's not going to work. Yeah, you can't really do that. Okay, but I wish you could. Oh, yeah, this is nice and cozy, my friends. Oh, this has been a good day. Ah. Hmm. Well, thank you all for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this mod review. Remember to go ahead and check out the mod. The link to download this mod will be down in the description below. Uh, and remember, if you've enjoyed this video, remember to hit that like button down below. I'm burning to death now. Hit that in water. So, thank you all, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.